One thing that you're gonna see every pro player do in COD Mobile is that they use a four finger HUD because four finger HUDs allow you to have a proper aim and do some crazy movements at the same time. But if you're using a bad HUD, then you're not really getting the full advantage of using four fingers. That's because your buttons are gonna be at the wrong place, your fingers are gonna be doing too many things at once, and overall it's gonna be a mess. And that's why today I'm gonna be showing you an awesome HUD that's gonna help you improve your gameplay. It doesn't matter if you're using two fingers or if you're already using four, you're gonna learn a lot from this HUD. So let's start by talking about the layout of this HUD. This is how the layout of this HUD looks like. So on the upper right hand of the screen, we got our jump, crouch, and prone buttons along with our ADS button. And our lethals and tacticals are going to be below our prone button for better access. And the less important buttons are going to be placed right here. Moving on to the bottom right hand side of the screen, we got our reload, C4, and plan bomb button on this order. And our weapons and health bar are going to be on the lower most part of the screen. And finally, for the right side, we're going to place our score streaks and our operator skill on the corner like this. Talking about the left side, there's really nothing much to explain. Basically, we got the hip fire and ADS to fire buttons overlapping each other on the top. And obviously, on the bottom, we have our joystick to control our character and finally make sure to put the minimap and scoreboard on the upper middle part of the screen so here's the final look of the layout before we move on to the finger placement so if you want to take a screenshot then now is the time okay so now let's talk about the finger placement for this hut so we're going to be using our middle finger for jumping crouching proning and also aiming down sight and the good thing about this hut is that you're going to have a great accuracy when you're throwing thermites and grenades because you're using the middle finger you can also use your index finger to do these four actions but if you have a bigger phone then you are going to get strains on your finger and that's why i prefer using the middle finger for the upper right side of the screen. Moving on to our thumb, we're going to be using this finger 90% for aiming. And because we're using our thumb 90% for aiming, you're going to notice a significant improvement on your aim after using this HUD. Besides that, we're also going to be using this finger for less frequent buttons like reloading, C4, and planting bomb. And finally, we're going to be using our thumb for switching to our primary or secondary weapon. For the left side of the screen, it's pretty straightforward because we don't have a lot of buttons on that side. Basically, we're going to be using our left index finger for the two fire buttons on the top. That means this finger is going to be used for hip firing and ADS2 firing as well. And obviously, the only thing that our left thumb is going to do is control our joystick. So now let's talk about some tips and tricks to get used to your new HUD. Now your fingers are still going to be used to the muscle memory of your old HUD. And in order to fix that, you need to play around 10 matches of hardpoint shipment before you can think about going into a ranked match. And also another thing I use when I'm playing COD Mobile is this app called Gear Up Booster. Basically, this app is going to give you a way smoother gameplay by reducing your ping. It really does help a lot if you sometimes have a bad connection. I'll leave the link of this app in the description if you guys want to try it out. And if you made it this far into the video, then congratulations. These are three VIP codes for Gear Up Booster. Again, and the link of this app is going to be in the description for you to try it out. And if you want to learn about the best settings in COD Mobile, then make sure to check out this video. I talked about some brand new settings that's going to help you get better in COD Mobile, so I highly recommend checking out that video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.